Hey everyone, it's Marissa, and I'm here with a small haul. Well, kind of small that I wanted to share with you. Um, I went to my local 99 cents only store, picked up a few things as well as the Dollar Tree. So I'm going to go ahead and show you what I picked up from the 99 cents only store. I picked up these Hello Kitty notebooks and pen set. Look at how super cute that is. Um, and look at the pen, so cute. And you can probably, well, I, I would probably um, go ahead and alter the pen as well. You can even do it, like put bling on the, um, on the bow. So I picked up two of those, and those, these were 99 cents. So I'm not sure where they have these stores. I know Southern California has the 99 cents only store, but as far as any other states, I am not sure. I don't believe so, but um, yeah, so I got that. And then I also picked up, um, I picked some up for a friend. I'm not sure if she's still looking for them. But um, do you guys remember Lisa Frank? Well, 99 Cent Store does have a lot of Lisa Frank items. So I picked up some stickers. And these are puffy glitter stickers. So I picked up one of each style. And look at how cute this one is. Isn't that super cute? This is a puffy um, sticker as well with glitter. So I picked up that one. And I picked up the one with the stars. And look at how adorable this one. Oh, look at the little, look at the little poodle on the um, ice cream cone. So cute. And then the last one I picked up were these hearts. And these hearts have bling in them. So that is what I picked up from the 99 only cents store. And then you guys can fast forward this if you guys are not interested in it. But um, I have a lot of birthdays coming up. And so I picked up some baggies, some gift bags. And I figured they had so many cute gift bags that I wanted to just go ahead and stock up. So um, from the Dollar Tree... I picked up some of these bags and look at how pretty this is. This is a gift bag and it has like the bouquet in the background and it says wish big. So I got that. I picked up this bag which one of the banners is dimensional on here and it came off. So I picked that up and these super cute bags. Look at this one. It's a slice of a piece of cake and then um that's the side and then the back is it does not have glitter but one side does so I got it in the cake I got it in the popsicle stick and I got it in the sundae look at how cute it even has a cherry on top and I'm just showing you what the sides look like and there's cherries on the side and then I got the donut and like I said, the back is the same thing, but with just not glitter. And this side for this one looks like that. So I picked up that. I picked up another cupcake. I picked up this one. I love the color and the glitter in this one. Picked up this one. And then I picked up this one, which is kind of similar to this, but just different color. And then last but not least, I picked up this bag. Look at how stinking cute that is. It's a pineapple. Um, there's a YouTuber that I watch. I don't remember her name. I think it's like Cheap Crafty Girl or something like that. But she did a video where she um, cut this down to size and made this her um, Happy Planner cover. And she laminated it and everything. And she has a tutorial on it. So um, I said, ooh, I got to get that. I don't know if I'm going to use it for that. But um, this was a cute gift bag. So I got that. And that is my haul. Oh, wait. No, no, no. Duh. Got some more things. So I found these. They're by Jot. And it's the self-inking stamps. So I got the XOXO. Handmade with love. And thank you. 
and I know that they have a lot of other ones out but these are the only ones that my local Dollar Tree had and then I found some of these um, jeweled barrel pens and they have like a pink bling on the top so I picked up two of those and I found some more of these pens and these were um, located um, in the by the cash register you know before you put your things on the conveyor belt it was like underneath and I happened to see it so I grabbed all the rest of the colors that they had so I picked up more of those and then I found some of the paper clips. It's about time. So I picked up the arrows and the hearts and the stars. And then they only had one bow left, one bow paper clips left. So of course I had to pick that up. So I was super excited to find that. And then I thought I would pick this up. It's an adhesive label holder. But I'm thinking that I can put this like on my um, my clear containers that I have. And then just put like cute paper in it right here. You know, to label things. So I picked that up. And that this comes with 18 pieces. So 18 adhesive labels. So that is my small haul, you guys. Um... I think there's something else that I wanted to show you guys, but I just can't remember. My evening is so crazy with my little one. She's being needy today. So, um, oh, okay. I, so, a while back, I bought these containers from the Dollar Tree. And I seen them once, and I never saw them again. So, I picked up three of them. So, I just wanted to show you um, how I organize my paper clips in here. So, and they all fit perfectly, except these, I think these are the American Crafts. I'm not sure. I picked these up from, um, I think, TJ Maxx, but they fit standing up, as well as these are the Prima Butterfly Paper Clips. They kind of fit at an angle, like standing up. So, I thought I would just share that with you guys. Oh, wait, and this one's from, um, I think this is the one from Hobby Lobby, so it, the camera... So it fit perfectly flat in there. So that's all, you guys. That's my quick video. Um, I hope everybody's week is going by quick. And um, happy hump day. And I will talk to you guys later. Bye for now. Thanks for watching.